welcome to Jeans Tight Lines and welcome to Curacao. My friend Michael, hey. who's very kindly guiding me this morning. It's really early, I was up at stupid o'clock this morning after all day traveling yesterday. Um, come down to this spot, met Michael. We're out guiding for the morning. Um, obviously the target fish is the tarpon, but there's an awful lot of species in here, so we'll see what we can get. We've got the fly rods. Um, we've just been having a good old chat about what's in here, potential records and stuff but we're going to smash some fish out. So come join us guys, tight lines and welcome to Curacao. Thanks for having me, my man. Yeah, man. Here we go guys, fish on. Not sure what we got. It's not very big, but it's a fish. And we've only been fishing five, 10 minutes. I think it's a small jack. But he's, he's certainly got some juice. Yeah. So this is on a small clouser minnow. What is this is Jack Trafell. Is it a small Traval, is it? Yeah. So if this is the fight a small one gives, who knows what a big one oh there's a small barracuda following him. Oh, you wanna eat it? There they are, look, look, look small barras. Oh, We've wow. flipped him. Hey, there he yeah, is, look. Yeah. Oh, it's a horse eye jack. Oh, it's a horse eye jack, is it? Yeah. Excellent. Excellent. There we go, folks. Small horse eye jack, and I've just saved him from being eaten. Excellent. Look at that, guys. All right, there you go, my friend. Thank you for the fun. First fish of the fun. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you, Michael. We're off the mark. The skunk is off the board. Right, so let's make another cast. So as you probably just saw then guys, that's on this, it's twisted up my leader. Oh, 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 oh. So that's on this small clouser minnow on my Reddington Predator and the, um, not the behemoth, but it's my nine weight setup. Whoa, there's fish everywhere. Right, let's see if we can get another one. They're on the feed. There's fish active over there, Michael. Yeah, you can see all the bait fish. Oh, twisted. So that's a first for me, a horse eye jack. Yeah. I've never caught one. I need to catch one today, Michael. There was a big tarpon, was there?
moon's still out, sun's coming up, the fish are biting. Doesn't get much more perfect than this really, does it mate? Yeah. Good company. Little bit of chop just starting to come up on the surface. Your back cast is getting really close to that mangrove. Yeah. Your back cast yeah. was <laughs> getting close. <laughs> that was right on the margin. Oh, oh, nearly. Come on, and again. I got bit then. Whoa, did you see that? What was I saying about trailing the fly? <laughs> Okay, so I was just doing what I'd done a minute ago, and just pulling this clouser across the surface yeah, yeah. doing my roll cast. Yeah, yeah, and again, close in, these fish are really aggressively going for it. So I'm now just gonna do really long strokes. Right, let's do some pike style pulls here. I'm not sure what they were and they weren't particularly big but whatever they were they wanted that fly. And again. Yeah. I think they're small barracuda. Well, there we go, yeah. fish on. Well, that's got some size to it. Bigger. Yeah, yeah. Here we go, folks. I think I might be leaving Michael this clouser. <laughs> well, this has got some weight to it. He's staying deep, whatever he is. Jack, maybe. Is he? There he is. It's only small, you know. Yeah, wow, is that? How can that small fish be? How can he be so strong? 
How can that be so strong? Wow, we look at that. What a fish, eh? That's why they're so strong. Look at the size of the pectoral fins on it. And it just gives them. I honestly thought that was a eight, ten pound fish. But that's why. That's where they get the power from, is those large pectoral fins there. A big tarp in there. Just seen a big tarpon. Go for it, Michael. And my heart's racing. I missed it. I saw the splash after. Right guys, I don't know if you can see this, but we've got a load of activity going on here. Now whether or not that's tarpon, is that tarpon do you think Michael? No, it's jacks. It's jacks, jacks on the feed. If you see this sometimes, they're also the tarpon swim between. Where they're crowing up the bait. Yeah, they, they, they love chasing the bar jacks. Bar jacks are full feeding. Right, so let's see if we can get. They also, we saw the bar jacks jumping everywhere. Yeah. One tail between. Damn, tarpon. Big tarpon tail. The tarpon tail want to eat. Don't want to eat. Whoa, and again, did you see that? Again, eh? In the last one. That's about the fourth time now. When you pull them up, you fly. Yeah. Then he takes it. When you're trailing it. Come on, fish. That's the cast. That's the one, Michael. You don't have to ask me twice to look for bonefish, Michael. <laughs> right, shall I reel up? Yes, Michael's in. Take it. Really? Yeah, of course, your fish. <laughs> Thanks, man. What we got? Look the bone. Is it a bone? It's a look a bone. It's this bone, is it? Yeah. I think so. Oh yeah, that's bone. Yeah, that's definitely bone. Woo! Yeah, man! <laughs> bone on! He takes it hard, you man. Shame I didn't hook it. That's for that uh, cable here, all right? Yeah. Go. Look at him go. go. You have it? Yeah, we've got him. We've got him beat. Just got to watch this. Little buff here. Well, the line is under the boat, though. You look later. Here, here. 
there he is he's gonna run again yes look at that that's a good bow mate yes <laughs> it's not my first bonefish but it's certainly the first i've played in the curacao yes That's a big bone. That's a really big bone. Oh, that's a good one, man. Beautiful, beautiful, yes. Beautiful. Oh, yes. Oh, man, beautiful. Take it, Graham, take it. Ah, oh, yes. He's in the boat. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> What a, beautiful fish. what a beautiful fish guys oh, man. look at that Whoa. well juggled as well look at that nice all right my friend we'll get you sorted hook out of causing any damage to his mouth. There we go. <laughs> Magnificent. Oh, beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Right. was just absolutely magnificent uh, Mike very kindly let me play the fish and there was a moment in my head where I thought if I let this line go slack we're gonna lose it so there's a bit of pressure on me and a bit of effort on my part to keep that fish on but we played it we landed it and it's gone back safely so that was absolutely epic so I've just taken off that um, clouds of minnow that I had on there and I've just put on this bonefish fly so I've got my bone flies with me and matching the pattern but Chiefy over there just had that on, I've gone for this. So we're just gonna work this area for a bit longer because my experience from Cuba is where there's one, there's normally a lot more. But that, and there's also just been a pelican working this area here. So that suggests to us that the fish are in and the sun's just getting high now. So it's perfect time for the bones. So we're gonna carry on fishing here for a little bit. Guys, that was absolutely epic. Tight lines, everyone. It's one of the... Um, occupational health hazards of fishing for bonefish in an area like this is barracuda yeah. cut that clean off look clean off right everybody that's today's session done yes um, quite a special day eh wonderful day wonderful day so mike was explaining to me that that bonefish for here is really quite very special um they do occasionally come out on the fly but mostly on laws um, and for one that size to come out on the fly and to land it was 
quite a special moment. Yeah, eh? We're both still really, really yeah. buzzing from it. So even for me, as guide here on Curacao, was this uh, the perfect catch for today? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. amazing. Well, a massive thank you from me. Thank Obviously, you. that goes without saying. I had an absolutely awesome day, my man. We did very good. It's been a long time in the making, eh? Yeah. Yeah. So, guys, um, we'll see you on our next adventure. Um, back in work tomorrow, or in work tomorrow, and then maybe a bit in the evenings, and then we've got next weekend. So, guys, stay tuned. If you haven't, please consider subscribing and tight lines. Thank you, Michael. Bye -bye. Hey, and also, yeah. go on to Facebook and check out Tarpon Fishing Curacao. Tarpon Fishing Curacao. Or on the internet, www.tarponfishingcurusau.com. There we go. Yes. So check it out guys, give him a like. Got some beautiful fish on there and he's a bloody cracking bloke as well. Guys, take it easy, tight night.